Scooters could be back on the streets very soon. Tonight, the Indianapolis City County Council approved a scooter regulation proposal. By a 19 to 6 vote, the council gave the go ahead to the proposal. Now, this proposal creates license fees up to $15,000 per year, plus a $1 per day per scooter operating fee. Now, under the proposed rules, riders can't use the scooters in the public right of way, including on sidewalks. The scooters can't be parked in loading zones, bus stops, or shelters, or on ramps leading to sidewalks, and counselors are aiming to hold the two companies responsible for ensuring the hundreds of scooters are working properly. They will be required to remove any broken scooters within two hours of being notified and provide a 24-hour customer service telephone number. We're going to work hand in hand alongside every one of the council members along the city and on the enforcement bureaus uh, to make sure we're educating our users and our non-users around why we're here, what, uh, how, how we're supposed to properly use scooters, um, and how we're not supposed to. So. Right now, all scooters are off the streets. The two operators, Bird and Lime, agreed to pull the scooters while counselors put regulations in place. Now these companies will have to apply for a license before the wheels start turning again on Indianapolis streets. As of now, August 1st could be the earliest to have the electric scooters running again.